We're here to raise money for the Lord's Taverners uh, and some of us to play cricket. I was hoping to play cricket today, but I think we've got 11 without me. Actually, I'm secretly quite pleased. But it's all about fundraising, helping children uh, in all sorts of walks of life who are less privileged than ourselves. Any width of problem, really, the Lord's Taverners will deal with through sport. I've been a Lord's Taverner for 30 years now. And they have these wonderful matches between strange groups of people. Uh, today it's between the Strictly Come Dancing team and the Lord's Taverners. So the Lord's Taverners play uh, the most weird people. And you can't get much more weirder than the Strictly Come Dancing team trying to beat the Lord's Taverners. But great fun. But they're much more important. It's all for charity. Everybody's here. Uh, we've had a great auction. Uh, we've been selling books, we've been doing everything goes to the charity, so it's very worthwhile. It's always interesting to tailor lots to the right people. We had uh, the chance to go around the studio where they produce these Strictly dresses, and uh, we had an example of one or two dresses in the marquee, and the wonderful Victoria Pendleton modelled one of the dresses, which must have helped a bit. £1,100, and so thank you so much. That's wonderful. Thank you. The Clifton Chronicles, hard back, he pointed out, uh, signed by him, and then a delivery of books by the publishers to the Dingley Centres. Uh, a quantity of books every single month, which will help, again, disadvantaged children uh, better themselves. I've done nine drafts of number five, so I know what's going to happen. And uh, I've never, never enjoyed writing so much in my life. So at the moment, very, very exciting. He tells a wonderful story. I think I've read most of his books. Um, and I love a, a series that um, crosses generations and therefore it, it enables the reader to really get immersed in the characters. Fantastic story. Four or five people on my table at lunchtime had read the book already. And I said to them, what's it like? And they all said, honestly, hand on heart, it's a really good read. So, got to read it. My prediction for the day, uh... It's quite a good wicket, so uh, I'm thinking rain. Rain. <laughs> Here's our star player now. Star player, the, the Pendleton. I've been a passionate supporter of cricket and lover of cricket since the age of six. I was the natural captain of the England cricket team. It's one of those disadvantages in life that I can't bat or bowl, and this seems to have held me up. I think I had my first net when I was about five, oh, and, and certainly played, yeah, played a lot. Love. I, I probably enjoy watching it now as much as I enjoy playing it. But coming here today to one of the most beautiful grounds in England, um, playing with some 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 legends, uh, and raising money for a good cause. Lord Taverners is a fantastic um, charity to be involved with. Um, what a lovely setting as well, Wormsley. Every time you get a chance to play at Wormsley, you jump at the chance. We're playing the game that we all love, um, with a smile on our face and laughing and raising lots of money at the same time.